So, I, do you use it, some technology at your classes? No, not at all. Yes, yes, of course <laughs> I do. Yes, uh, I have to. We are in that era. Yes. Um, so, I usually give them uh, two links, usually a dictionary online that they can have for free, um, and then some sites that I know of that they are very good for them, that they can even uh, have some work at home um, and to be independent, to be um, autonomous users to, of, of English. Good. What about in you? In my classes, uh, we have the <coughs> Escola Virtual in yeah. Portugal and uh, I, I can choose one, two or three texts that they can listen the, the spelling rules, the accent of some words, and then repeat them. And after the, the text, they can do the reading comprehension, yeah. grammar exercises. Yeah. There are some PowerPoints that shows the students uh, what kind of rules they put on the present simple, the present continuous, and uh, you can you can keep their attention yeah. to you and to, to the board yeah. with the projection of some exercises and some yeah. texts. I really like those videos where they have the listening exercise yes. and the comprehension and they have the true or false but also uh, multiple choice exercises yes, yes. and then we can I comment. Agree. It's yes, like um, a language laboratory that they can listen and they can actually repeat also the words. Yes, and they, they like it. They yes, like to they listen and repeat. Yeah. And uh, uh, after all, they can do another debate yes. about the theme about the topic, or uh, yeah. a composition of writing exercise yeah. and then uh, maybe translate that to Portuguese yeah. or, uh, or even uh, work in pairs to do it. Okay. Yes, I do it very, very well. <laughs>